It's a beautiful morning, a perfect day for worship. It feels good to be back at church, just like any ordinary Sunday. But of course, while many things are the same, in these extraordinary times, some things will be just a little bit different. Let me explain. Why look, here's our sibling in Christ, John Q. Churchgoer. Good morning, John. All ready for worship? Good, good. But if you don't mind my saying so, you look a little uncovered. And that's right, John. Everyone needs to wear a mask on the church property. Hold on a moment, John. You breathe out of your nose, too. That's right. Cover your nose and mouth. All ready then, John? Great. We'll see you inside. When you first enter the church building, a few things may look a little different. The doors will be open before worship, so you don't have to touch them. And look on the floor. Markers every six feet to help maintain social distancing in the hallways and stairwells. Good idea, eh? Let's go on. Say there, friend, what are you doing? Hanging your coat up, eh? Well, normally that's a nice idea, but I think you'll have a little trouble with that. You see? no hangers. Remember, you should keep your coat and belongings with you while you're in the building. Don't leave it there. That's fine. Keep marching to Zion. Oh, hold on there, John. Didn't Mother always say to always try if you get my drift? Uh-oh. Can't open it, eh? Maybe you should take a look at the handy new lock on the door. In use. Well, that explains that. That's all right, John. It just means you'll have to use the ladies' room. No, oh, I'm just teasing, John. There are no more men's or ladies' rooms, remember? Every restroom is now a single-person restroom for everybody, so it's safe as can be. Go ahead. Be sure to lock the door behind you, one person at a time, remember? And be sure to wash your hands. At least 20 seconds, please. There you go. That wasn't so bad, was it? Well, let's not forget why we're here. Worship. Onward, Christian soldier. But don't be startled if you see another human being first. Good morning, he says. Welcome to Kingston Presbyterian. Would you like a mask? Oh, right. You've already got one. Well, we've got hand sanitizer if you like. And please, come in for worship. When you get to the sanctuary, you'll see a few new things. The hymns and envelopes have been removed just to keep things extra safe. Offering plates are at the entrances to the sanctuary. You can put your offering in as you enter or as you leave, however you choose. Now to find a seat. What's this? Jesus said, come and follow me. Find me in another pew funny stuff. So let's keep looking. The open pews are spaced farther apart to meet health recommendations by the Presbytery. Here's one right here. And there's a bulletin waiting for you. If it was a communion Sunday, there'd be an individually sealed juice and wafer there as well. It's time for worship. Have a seat and follow along with your bulletin. The pastor and the worship leader are speaking behind protective plexiglass to keep things extra safe. Say, that's the usher from before. He sure looks familiar. Some things in worship will be changed slightly to ensure that this is a healthy space for all to enjoy. Oh, it's time for some music. Hold on, John. This song's not for singing. I know how much you love singing, but it's not safe right now. That's right. Listen 
and sing in your heart. You can always listen to a recording of the worship service and sing out loud at home. Worship will be a time of reflection for listening to scripture, the sermon, music, and of course, prayer. Afterwards, you can greet people and share signs of peace, from a safe distance, of course. But to keep things safe, try not to linger and make your way out of the building as soon as you can. Have some sanitizer for the road. And in addition to the restrooms near the assembly hall, there's also two more single-person restrooms available, one at the top of the stairs and one at the bottom. And then have yourself a good week, having gathered as the family of God, even if it's a little different. We're still getting to worship God together. Now say, John, did you enjoy worship today? That's good. What's that? Oh, and also with you, friend, and also with you.